So we have a very early main slate for both DraftKings and FanDuel. So 105, 105 p.m. East Coast time start. And I don't usually make videos when, um, you know, main slate is, is early like this. Because I usually, you know, people need time to watch the video. I can't expect everybody to just drop what they're doing to watch my video. Some people watch it, you know, under what, or some people listen on their way to work. Some people listen at work. People have specific times when they listen to their YouTube videos, and I respect that. But this is this is a special edition. This is a donkey of the day edition. You feel me? And um, what I'm about to say got to be said. Because we had an early slate this morning, and, you know, I enjoy making MLB lineups for both FanDuel and DraftKings. It's like putting a puzzle together. And um, I made my lineups. I decided to go with Kyle Gibson from the Cardinals, you know. So, I put my lineups together. I sent out my lineups to whoever I got to send my lineups out to. And I'm just going to, you know, take it easy, have a nice, you know, relaxing, you know, Wednesday morning, you know. And all of a sudden I see, I get an alert, Kyle Gibson scratched. So when I go to pivot, when I go to pivot and just put any other pitcher in there, just get a pitcher in there, somebody, I realized that the slate started. I'm like, oh, we... We, we acting like the NBA now. Okay. No worries. So, regardless of the dollar amount, if it's $0.25, cents, if it's $50, if it's $100, I hate playing that lineup from jump. I hate that. I hate that feeling. No, your lineup has no shot. We all hate it. I'm sure you guys can empathize, right? We've all been there. So... I had a FanDuel first because I got I had Kyle Gibson in both FanDuel and DraftKings, so I um I sent him a I sent him a a, a text like an email whatever like yo I need my I need I need my um my entry fee back because you know Kyle Gibson got ruled out after lock so usually what they say they'd be like well see if you cash anyway if you don't cash. Hit us up again. We'll send you the entry fee. Usually that's how it used to go. The last two times they've been acting a little crazy. But I'm like, all right, let me just see what they say. So they send me back an email quick. Like, yo, when you play fantasy sports, just the risk you take. Unfortunately, we can't credit you back here. So I just, I just end the chat. All right. Cool. And I, and I, I told them before. I'm like, listen. I understand that. You have your policies, but you got to keep in mind that I promote y'all. I promote y'all platform every single day on YouTube. So, like, I'm not telling them I want any any special perks, but just you know, consider that when you dealing when you're dealing business with me, because I'm about to go back to my people and tell them the experience that I had. Because a lot of people come to me and tell me the experience they had. With, 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 with these platforms. But I have a whole YouTube channel. Like would you want somebody expressing the 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 runnings, the the, the 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 issues with the platform that we're all using? So that was that was Fandle. So I ended that chat, went to DraftKings. So I send them an email, they say, Alright, we're gonna send you an email back. Cool. So not like so right after I get off of FanDuel, DraftKings sent me an email. It was like we are not like it wasn't even no kind of like we understand it was none of that. It was like we are not refunding Kyle Gibson. Um Um We're not we're not refunding for Kyle Kyle, Kyle Gibson scratch. Da 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 I'm like, yo. And I also let them know. That I'm a YouTuber and I make videos, you know, about their platform. And these people don't care. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm I don't it's not about the money. It was very low dollar amount um um tournament. So it wasn't no it wasn't no big deal. But 
when you when you in business, when you deal with people, you you got to treat them some type of way. You don't got to you don't got to give anybody anything for free, but you got to make them feel like, you know, like you got to make them feel like they like like you just don't want to make them feel like shit. When you go to your favorite restaurants, when you go to your favorite stores, when you frequent your favorite pl- p- places, it's because the people make you feel like you're somebody. You understand what I'm saying? It's not about the money. You go to the same restaurants all the time because they greet you with a nice big smile and a, and a warm greeting. And they make you feel like, you're, you know, they're happy to see you. These fucking idiots, they don't even give a damn. They don't even like. Like, you got people playing whole contests, drawn dead in the water, and it's not about the money. But, like, yo, you know what? We we, we we absolutely get it. That is very frustrating that you're playing dead. You know what? Let me talk to my boss and let me send you a, a, a voucher for future something. They don't care. Just acknowledge us. They don't care. So, I, I and now I'm going to spread awareness. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to, I'm going to. I'm going to tone it down my spending with these platforms if this is the way they want to play. I already deleted Superdraft. I already deleted a whole bunch of other platforms. You know what I'm saying? I'm not playing with people, man. I, I don't need FanDuel and I don't need DraftKings to make a living. And I set it up that way because I don't ever want anybody to think I need them. People are crazy. Listen, let's get to the slate. Let's get in and get out. Let's start with DraftKings. Let's look at the point guards up top. You got Louis Louis Skill going up against Baltimore. He's been pitching lights out, but Baltimore's been hitting lights out. So, got Godzilla versus King Kong. I don't want none of that mess. Who's next? You got Seth Lugo. Looks good against Oakland. Oakland been putting the back to the ball. I've been telling y'all about Oakland. Castillo's pretty much okay. He's been mad this season. Just meh. Cleveland. Should pat should put back to the ball. I don't mind getting some Cleveland bats. Mackenzie Gore against Arizona. I wouldn't mess with Arizona. Last time I I tried to play a mid range pitcher against him, I got smoked. You see, you feel me? So I'm a little bit um, I'm a little butt hurt. I ain't gonna be messing with Arizona like that. Irvin against the Yankees. <sighs> no judge may not play. As of now. You got Soto, you got Volpe. I don't think I need to mess with the Yankees. All their guys hit, so I don't think I need to go that route neither. It's not looking good so far. Little against Minnesota. I play Minnesota almost every slate. What I tell you about Royce Lewis, I told y'all about Royce Lewis. I play him every slate. Um, Stone against Colorado. Colorado, like yo, this is the season for the bats because. Like almost every pitcher is getting lit up nowadays. It's very rare that you get a, a ace, you know, a ace light performance. Very rare. Even I think, what's his name? Um, Crochet. I think he got hit up by Houston. You know what I'm saying? So it's hard. It's hard. Um, I actually was looking at Arigetti against the White Sox since the White Sox is one of the worst hitting teams. I was looking at Arigetti as a mid as a mid range pitcher. Um, Woods Richardson, Tampa Bay starting to hit now. All these teams are starting to hit. Logan Allen is awful, so I don't mind getting pieces of Seattle. Maybe um, Cal Raleigh, maybe Julio Rodriguez. Um, the rest of these pitchers, I'm not going to be touching, to be honest with you. And the Dodgers have are, are priced out of their mind, so it's hard to get Dodgers. Um, it's just hard right now. It's hard. Let's just see what we can do. I, I'm going to pick up Arigetti. If, if it works out, it works out. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But I'm not feeling too confident in, in the guys that are more expensive. So I'm, I'd rather just pay 7600 and pay it for bats, to be honest with you. To be honest with you. <sighs> um, Chris Flexen is awful. Houston, I'm gonna pick up Altuve. Uh, where are we? Let's pick up Altuve. I'm not really confident in the rest of them. Uh, maybe Diaz, but I'll just play Altuve for now. Um, nothing wrong with a little bit of a one-off. 
The rest of these guys up here, Soto. I don't mind touching Soto. That sounds crazy. Pause. I don't mind playing Soto. Let me see who else is here. Royce Lewis. Screw it. Let's pick up Royce Lewis. Let's pick up Castro. Is Castro going to... I prefer Castro to bat lead off again. So just keep your eye on that. If Castro doesn't bat lead off, maybe you could bat whoever's gonna you could you could play whoever's gonna bat in front of Lewis. Lewis should Lewis should hit cleanup, I believe, or third. So whoever's one or two, you could play if it's not Castro. Just keep your eye on that. Um now let's get one more player. Let's get out of here. Let's pick up Cole Raleigh. So we get a piece of Seattle. Cause Logan Allen's gonna give up the long ball to somebody. Rodriguez is 5K. Cal Raleigh is 42. So let's do that. Let's, that's what we're going with for DraftKings. All right, we're gonna go to FanDuel in a second. If you're new here, welcome. Appreciate you taking the time to watch my video. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. Hit the bell. Thumbs up the video. If you're struggling to catch in baseball, I know baseball is very different from NBA. Um, takes a little bit of a minute to get, but don't worry. If you need help, I got you. Check out the Patreon link in the description, or you can check out the channel memberships, which also have lineups, and we do have super chats that are open. Um, let's go to let's go to Fanduel, and I know some people. No, not you guys, but there's some people every once in a while I get somebody that might trickle in and they be like, yo, I don't want to hear your stories. But you know what? I have a big problem with respect. Like, I have a big issue with respect. And when you don't respect somebody, my, my antenna is go up. You know, that's why I go off when people leave stupid comments. I don't bother nobody. I don't bother anybody. I don't like bullies. I don't like people that treat people like they're less than. So when I see that or I feel that, I'm going to speak on it. Nobody can stop me. And the last few encounters I've had with FanDuel and DraftKings, it's like, oh, you, you, you know what you got just, you, you know what you got signed up for. Like, that's not how you deal with people. And it's not about the money. It's, it's that you acknowledge people that are paying for your service. You, you acknowledge people that spent I've been I've been on these platforms since 2015. It is 2024. 10 years you can't do a quick search and be like oh we this guy's been with us for 10 years let me let me let me try to make things right with him that's all i'm asking i i don't expect you to 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 reimburse every single person that played kyle gibson but you know you you know if you're a business person be tactical because you want that person to come back you see what i'm saying be very tactical when my patreons the ones that pay for basketball, when basketball was over, what did I do? Send them baseball, WNBA, whatever, just so they know, like, oh, you, oh, there's no basketball, so now you don't get nothing? Nope. Nope. That's not how it works. We all, you you pay for something, you're going to get something. You're getting something because it's only right. That's how I treat people. And I, I, I Whatever. Let's get a picture for FanDuel. Let's get out of here. I held you up long enough. I'm sorry. All right. Um. Ah. Uh, these pictures. I think Luis Castillo. I feel like he's gonna get smoked. I just feel it in my guts. Seth Lugo. You want to take a shot on Seth Lugo? I hope that Oakland don't go don't go off. Let's do it. Let's see what he's been doing. I know he's been decent. Let's see what he's been doing. We're gonna take a shot. Um. The Dodgers, two runs, four strikeouts. The Yankees, four runs, four strikeouts. Cleveland, five runs, five strikeouts. Now, in his defense, those are three of the best hitting teams in the league. He's, he's had a little bit of a, a a tough stretch as far as opponent-wise, but he's been still putting up decent numbers, 34-21, 18-40, 37-47. So, you know what? You know what? Let's fire him up. We're going to fire him up. Unfortunately, we probably can't play Otani in this lineup because he's like 5,300. 
Royce Lewis. Let's pick up Royce Lewis once again. Just throw him at third base because he. I'm just gonna keep playing him. Royce Lewis, Bobby Witt, um, one of the other Dodgers other than Otani. While he's 5300, like these guys, I'm playing every slate. Um, let's see. Let's pick, like Will Smith. Let's pick up Will Smith. Because I'm not paying for Otani, so we'll get the next best thing. We'll 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 get Will Smith. Let's get some value pieces and let's get out of here. Let's go to let's go to Seattle. Seattle should be cheap. Um Julio Rod look, Rodriguez is thirty three hundred. Cal Raleigh is twenty nine. So we're gonna put Cal Raleigh at utility. We're gonna put Julio in the outfield and boom, here you go with FanDuel. Um, if you don't want to pay for value bats or a, a lot of value bats, then I suggest you take out Lugo and find a cheap pitcher. But these slates have gotten a lot tougher since they started pricing up Judge and Otani and, and guys like that. But listen, I appreciate your time. I appreciate, appreciate y'all listening to me, me rant. Um... Don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell, thumbs up the video. Check out the Patreon link in the description. Check out the channel memberships. Um, silver and gold do get you lineups. Let's read the description. Read the, read the, yeah, read the description. We do have super chats open. Um, I know the slate starts rather quickly. If you send me, you know, if you have a question, throw it in the chat. I'll try to get to it before lock and other than that i appreciate you all and uh i'll talk to you later ciao